Hello, it this side video, I want to show you how to wire S7 1200 PLC and its IO modules. I'm using free tool called Kelectro Tech, which is quite powerful and saves lot of work. First let's install Kelectro Tech. After installation create new project, fill up header informations and start drawing. We will be drawing wiring diagram for Siemens PLC, exactly 1214 CDC DC DC. First DC stands for 24 volts DC power supply, second for DC inputs and third for DC outputs. So let's add single pole source and 24 volt DC supply. Always give names to every wire. For protection we can use fuse or circuit breaker. There is a lot of macros of different products, including Siemens PLCs. It's split into five parts, but it's just one physical PLC. Connect 24 volt DC power supply and Insert input and output terminals.
If you're not sure about wiring, search for 1200 manual, as there are example wiring. Make sure you're watching right type of PLC. I will insert the picture inside drawing for easier navigation. This input wiring configuration is used for syncing inputs. If you're not sure what does it mean, check my other video, where I explained that. There will be one capacitive sensor wiring into input 0. Output will be switching relay coil. Never mix up AC and DC coils, because if you put relay or contactor with AC coil into DC circuit, it will get damaged. One more verify that drawing is matching example diagram and that's it. I'm no draftsman, as I don't enjoy this kind of work, but from time to time you will have to update or create some electrical drawings. Also now you know, why is Siemens PLC wired this way and that wiring examples can be found in manual. That's it for today.
we created simple wiring diagram and in future episodes we will update it as there will be more IOs. As always all links and bellow video and if you enjoy this series, don't forget to subscribe.